you ought to go with Rogue. Two of you together got the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. You're up, Johnny. I trust you. Take the wheel. Just, uh, go easy on us, yeah? Thanks, V. I'll get us through this. You'll see. See you on the other side. That's right. Even if I gotta burn this whole fucking city Look down. who we have. I'll put it to you this way, Wakako. Don't get in my way. You're running your little operation only because I have allowed it. And I can change my mind whenever I want. Hang on, give me a sec. V? Try again, Rogue. Got one more guess. Johnny. We'll talk soon, Wakako. What do you want, Johnny? Jesus, who died? Not happy to see me? Frankly, I'm not sure. Why? We had fun at the movies, didn't we? We're not at the movies anymore. Plus, got a good idea why you're here. You want something. And that's always a bad sign. Pretty tight setup you got, Rogue. Queen of Night City. Couldn't have been easy to achieve all this. So many others failed. The hell's that supposed to mean? Somehow missed the last 50 years. Just trying to get my facts straight. Fill in some gaps. And? You learn anything useful? Just that no one from our old crew got a happy ending. No one but you. Hey, everybody! We're closed! Oh, what gives? Now. We ain't finished yet! Oh, yes, you is. Shish, what's the matter? Nothing. Your shift's done. You're heading home to kick your feet up. Okay. Guess I'ma go back to work. We'll have the whole place to ourselves? Hmm. VIP treatment. Now talk. Just what the hell are you insinuating? That my bottle behind the bar? Yep. Been waiting there. Just... I never knew what the fuck for. But I'm starting to get some good ideas about how I might use it. Chose a cozy life for yourself. I'm just curious what it cost you. We all pay a price for the choices we make. I'm no exception. That what you tell yourself when you're cashing corp checks? That's what I tell myself when I stand over the graves of the crew from the Atlantis. It's what I tell myself when I look at you now. Well, hey, the past is the past. That's right. But that's not why you're here. You want to drag me into something again, and this chatter is just a prelude. This body, I'm trying to... I'm not... Fuck. V's dying and I'm the fucking cancer killing him. But the process can be stopped. I just no, have to... Johnny. Don't start. Don't tell yourself you're out to help someone. It's only ever about you, so you can feel better. You sure about that? Yeah. Same as it was with Alt. Wasn't even about guilt, that. Just some fucking sense of personal discomfort. Well, maybe I've changed. I'm running out of time, Rogue. 
When that fucking clock strikes 12, Johnny will disappear and V will go with him. Need to get myself out of his head before that happens. We managed to contact Alt. She agreed to help. But? Only one place we can do it. A data fort. Makoshi. And the only access point we got a chance of reaching is tucked snugly under Saka Tower. Arasaka? Again? Should have seen that coming. Only an idiot does the same thing over and over, while expecting things to work out differently. You even have a plan for this? We need bodies, you know the kind. And we need gear, best money can buy. And some luck. Hopefully a little fucking luck. Did you say we? That's right, can't possibly work without you. So what, I dust off and load up my tsunami? Rejoin your crusade against Arasaka? Bingo. When? Dunno. Now? Hmm. And what makes you think I'd agree? Owe it to yourself. Is that so? Sure, you can just be the queen of the ball in Night City. But that's not the real rogue. The real rogue you buried while you climbed to the top. Look deep. I know you can find her again. Shit. Knew this would happen one day. That one night, by some fucking miracle, you'd waltz in here and tear everything down. Some things never change. And us, have we changed? I don't know. Well, what do you say we go find out? Will you lend me a hand? Shut the fuck up, Johnny. Just stop talking. Fucking Christ. <laughs> every time. Every time. Never have I seen one not drunk as a pig sleep over 20 hours. Next time you're losing teeth. Think so? I would like to see you try. But the boss would not be happy when I break your bones. Mean rogue. There's only one boss. Let's go. The boss awaits. See you two said your hellos. Excellent. Rogue, what's this specimen doing here? He's our pilot and our ride to Corpo Plaza today. Rogue. You're the best. Of course I am. Your sorry ass wouldn't be here otherwise. Gears over there. Help yourself. Don't mind if I do. Johnny, you'll need gear. Take a look. Mm. 
What are these? Retro thrusters. anti -graves. Strap them to your legs and you can jump from damn near any height. Christ, Johnny, I'm not your fucking babysitter. Never mind. Got it. Okay now, gonna tell me what the plan is. Yep, jacking the shark. Targets the Makoshi access point in Arasaka Tower. Need to reach the lab floor. Hold it just long enough to do what we need to do, then get out alive. Arasaka Tower's a fortress, the most secure building in Night City. Walking in through the front door just ain't an option. So, we'll get in through a window of our own making. Specifically, we fly in on a Militech Strix tactical bomber. First, we rain fire on the building's air defenses from a high altitude. Then we breach a wall on the 76th floor, jump from the AV, and survive the landing thanks to our anti-grabs. That's right. We'll land smack in the middle of a tropical rainforest. Contrary to popular opinion, Arasaka has panache at times. We cut our way through the jungle to a shaft located on the tower's vertical axis. The shaft runs the height of the building, we use our retro thrusts again. Reach the bottom floor quickly. We'll surprise the socks off security. They'll be in disarray. Resistance should be minimal. We hit the lab floor running, reach the access point. The rest will be in your hands. I'll hold for applause. As I said, there's only one boss, one queen. Sheesh, didn't say you had a bomber. We all have our secrets. Guess nowadays a slick red Musutani just doesn't cut it. How'd you get that? I'm the best fixer in town, idiot. Enough said. Now focus on the plan. Saying we're gonna rain fire on these assholes. Seriously. I've waited too long for this. Don't bust out of your pants just yet. If we want to survive, we gotta do a lot more. Here comes the tricky bit. We're gonna knock a Jerujan 0401 ComSat off its orbit. Blood clot satellite! We're gonna make history, friends! That'll freeze comms in NC, NorCal, and SoCal. Should buy us three or four hours. No coordination, no support, complete chaos. to tell me that apart from that fucking bomber, you have a weaponized space shuttle. Got a certain acquaintance at Orbital Air. Mystery benefactor. Highly positioned informant. I'll pay him enough to give us access to the Jerujan. The rest will be up to our old Netrunner friend. You mean old? Only one I know who can rip an Arasaka satellite out of the sky. Contacts at Orbital Air, eh? You really are the queen of fixers. Better be grateful. Call them my best assets for you. Brew all this up while I was asleep. Actually, I brewed it up while you were dead. A finger in the comms network pie when corp conflicts start to heat up again could be worth gold. Cause nothing stands to make you more at ease than more.
supposed to talk to Alt anyway. I'll convince her. Don't fuck this up, Johnny. It's the one thing I can't do for you. Said I'd do it and I will. So summing up, we fly to our socket tower unnoticed and say hello with a welcome basket of missiles. Exactly. Then we jump in, find the building's vertical axis, and work our way down. To the Makoshi access point. Yep. What'd you think? See, just one problem. There's no coming back from this. You'll burn bridges. To ash and dust. All our Arasaka's gonna be gunning for you. Yeah, probably Orbital Air will too. But as I see it, they braided this whip that's gonna sting them. So, what do you think? Plan's got more gaping holes than a kabuki dollhouse. But fuck it, it's gotta work. It won't be the stupidest stunt we've ever pulled. Rogue. What? Just thank you. Thank me later. There's still the matter of alt. Do you know how to move around cyberspace? Well, V got some practice under his belt. Sure I'll manage. Head out back. Nix will show you the ropes. And you, Wayland, heat up the street. With you soon. How long you gonna be? Might I have time for a nap? <laughs> hey, so you the one gonna dive, right? That is the plan. Right on. Hop into a suit. Then have a seat over there. I'm finishing up for the day. So you be resurfacing on your own. And don't fuck with my gear. So? Then why do I see her in front of me? You see Alt because you wish to. It's a defense mechanism. Your explicit memory is simply creating a replacement image. It's weird. Like Having I'm... Having a bad dream. You read my thoughts? An oversimplification. You still deny what you are. A construct. A set of data. I... Know you. You know me. Like lines of code. So why even bother talking if you know my thoughts? As action precedes reaction, so Johnny Silverhand speaks before he thinks. Huh. That's some kind of joke? Only a sliver of memory from Alt's sense of humor. So what else do you know? The complexity of your emotions. Time is short. Netwatch could detect our local net traffic. How much you know about satellites? Did you God one that? Zero four zero one. I can manage it. Holy fuck! You're doing it now. You're reading I my. I agree with the plan. It will get you inside Arasaka Tower. C can you just hold on a second? You will breach Arasaka Tower and locate the port into Mikoshi. This is the program that will establish the link. I will send it with you on a splinter. Upon your opening of a back door, I will be able to circumvent the data fort security protocols. And then? You will be separated from V. And Mikoshi will cease to exist. Serious shop talk now, Alt. 
This is a jailbreak for the others, right? The little souls will fly free. Yes. Not good enough. I know there's more to it. Just spill it. They will become part of something greater. Nope. Keep trying. Don't understand. Because it is not something you can understand. Fine. Have it your way. Is that everything? W wait Just one other thing. I have no more time for you. You know what? Think you are right. Alt's gone. Oh, for Christ. Perfect. Go on. Fuck off. Fuck this. I don't know if you can hear me, but thanks for trusting me. Let's do this. They're an escrow. Paperwork's with Asukaga and Finch. Yeah, everything's fine. Got no reason to worry. Now, pull over. Kill the engine and have a nice long look at the stars. Simply that. You won't regret it. Gotta go. I love you. Biggest raid of your life in that getup? Really? What, not catching my good side? Won't exactly shed many bullets, but that's your problem. Ready? Rogue, who was that? My son. Wasn't expecting that. You telling me you, uh, you got a, uh... Private life. Yeah. And we'll leave it at that. Asked if everything's ready. Yeah, it's ready. Good. Now come on, or that lunatic will take off without us. I like this joint. Gonna miss it. To the very top. So, Wayland, what you tell him about the job exactly? Only what he wanted to know. His cut. He any good? Aiming to be an NC legend before long. Hmm, aren't we all?
You've got the whole city at your feet. The whole fucking city. Where no one can make you do shit. Not even those motherfuckers. No idea how this is gonna end, but let me tell you, it'll be one loud morning. Time we gave this city another wake-up call. Jesus, it's so beautiful. About to get even prettier, too. The hell you say? You two take a pop at your chair? <laughs> I wish, Squama. Eyes on the sky, everybody. Coming in makes an entrance in three, two, and one. Whoa, was that the Jerusalem? Still breathing? Waylon never jumped. Crashed by the waterfall. I'll try to re-establish contact with him, then find someone who's got access for the elevator going down. Wayland, you read me? How many pieces you in? Still one, I hope. And I think the local tribe's taken an interest in me. We'll get you out of there. Don't move. As if I could. We're going after Wayland. Got it. Occupied at the terminal. Slipping by is an option, and so is taking him out. I'll follow your lead. See if we can't use this term somehow. Okay, to the bird. Finally. Let's get to work. Hey, Wayland, you hear me? Loud and clear. Doors all of mine. We each get one. Johnny, choice is yours. All units report. Opening fire.
See that one? A high ranker, holding the access we need. All yours, Johnny. As Spider Murphy loved to say, look what the cat dragged in. Let's grab the access token and make for the elevator. Access token. Now, the elevator. The atrium. Jesus. It was just a month ago I met with Michiko Arasaka here. Empty hallways, offices. Just like back then. Remember? Of course I do. You've changed, you know? Finally grown up. And you're still the best. So, the security rooms are on the lower level. We'll need to plow through. Elevators are still jammed. Gotta jump. That's a long way down. Precisely why I told you to bring the antigraphs. Down bottom. Johnny, careful now. I'll never get tired of this.
which way now? Security room. Need to find the elevator to the labs. Fastest route to Mikoshi. In. Can't open it from here. Probably a control term nearby. woman out of her box. Let her show us what she's got. Hey, you've always been the one. Know that, right? I do. Just to shame you. Well, could have been worse. I'll see. Then she could through the ice. Elevator, now. Netrun Operations Control. 2067. An Arasaka bodyguard shields the Emperor of Japan from Assassin's Blood. 2071. that look? Got something on your mind? Ever think back about why we did it? Did what? Why we took on the corpse, strapped in leather, chrome, and iron. Don't know, John. We were young. Hot blood in our veins, shit judgment in our heads, like all pups. We fought for beauty, not knowing what was good or true. It was only the beautiful that meant a damn thing to us. Don't let your mind wander. We'll kick around old brain cells over vodka once we're done. My treat, eh? Or people with stories of the olden days, just like my grandparents. Arisaka Netrunners have stormed the tower's systems. Stopping their advance is my priority. Continue on your way alone. I've cleared a path. Made a run for it. Hurry. Wound up and a turret fodder. Oh, shit. Cunningham's these last decades. Shit eater 
Sanders never even stood a chance. Come on, the way down's beyond the door. I'm Johnny. Listen to me, you bored son of a bitch. Rogue meant more than you or I ever could. Best there ever was. And you killed her. She knew the risks. Silverhand. Wanted to flatline him something bad, didn't you? I mean, you swore you'd crush me. Silverhand. How is this even possible? We've come full circle. Set back then, I'd have finished you off without a thought. Now... Look, pussy. Always and forever. You don't know shit. We've all changed. Yesterday's convictions mean nothing today. Fifty years back, we killed in the name of all that was beautiful. Today, we can kill only in the name of those beautiful memories.
with all later, so figure I'll just say this now. On V's behalf, thanks. As for me, I'm sorry. out of nature I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing but such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make of hammered gold and gold enameling to keep a drowsy emperor awake or set upon a golden bough to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium of what is past, or passing, or to come. Hey, V. Happy to see me? Not exactly. Blacked out, then woke up here. I miss anything? Rogue's dead. Smasher was there. I'm sorry. Shouldn't be. Died for me, not for you. Is my body still in one piece? Parked it in Arasaka Tower's basement, plugged it into the network. Figured as much. Your output's been torturing my brain with Soul Killer for a good while now. You'll be all right. I mean, look, you made it this far. Awareness of what's happening right now, that just raunches. Like, Alt neatly packed me into an engram. Couldn't even tell when, or how. So what do you think? Like being a clump of ones and zeros? At first, the phantom pain. Jesus. Felt like my whole body was on fire. Realize now it's not pain at all. It's just some digital simulacrum. Guess Alt's gonna start moving this digital psyche I am back into my flesh, but... Got no idea if I'll survive or what I'll be if I do. 
Soul killer. We can't feel it doing its thing. How come? Should be pissing our panties in pain right now. Digital analgesia. We're data streams. Certain sensations, inputs can be blocked. Blah, 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 yada, yada. Alt, make you suffer through an exhaustive lecture? Imparted it instantly. Whatever. She did say she'd destroy Mikoshi, just as you agreed. Gonna release all those poor bastards, only suck them into her own bosom. Make them part of herself. So we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now. No. What the... Alt? I made a mistake in excluding the body as a factor. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit it out! In human terms! V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. Check again. If V's engram is damaged, can't you fix him? Hardware. Therein lies the problem. The organism's neurons have been dying for a time. Any attempt at a procedure upon its brain would result in the latter's death. You're a fucking genius! Think of something! Enough, Johnny! Shut up! I need to think! Gonna be alright. I said, something. give me one fucking minute. Oh, come on. There's gotta be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V, who is an intruder there. The situation is different for you. All changes were made to accommodate you. Hang on. Telling your ex to kick me out of my own body? The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. I will not interfere in your personal affairs, but while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Give us what the hell for? So he can trick me into a green? Giving you a free pass, even though he can already do what you want with my body? Let's just think a sec about what to do. Listen, Johnny. I'm glad we met. Got to know each other. And I'm sorry. I don't want to die. Who does? But I just don't see a way out. Talk to the pistol, Sophia. Yeah. Said you'd take a bullet for me. Yeah. And I haven't changed my mind. But this bullet's aimed my way. So I just gotta make sure I don't drag you down to the grave with me. Don't make this any harder, right? Just... Don't forget I came
fuck. Don't think I'll ever get used to this. Everything. And I gotta stop talking to you, V. Best not leave this lying around. Got a bit of time. Think I'll manage to swing by and visit you too. Not much, but I'm all right with that. Gonna need a ride. Steve. Gotta talk to Steve. that new album from Curse These Metal Hands. First four tracks? Preen, genius. Been practicing those chord progressions. Got the shivers first time I played it. But, gets kinda lame further in. Yeah, Bet you but didn't I get that boxing. shiner all by yourself. Doubt I'll... Um... Old man. Yeah, forgot to wake him up. Trying, though. Practice, Jumba. You'll get it in the end. Eventually, you won't even have to think about it. You'll just feel the flow. Been working on another song. Want to hear it? Later, maybe. Kind of in a hurry now. Need wheels and a good driver for the day. Couple of things in town I gotta take care of. No problem. I'll take you. My mom wigs out when I don't tell her I'm leaving. But it's not like she can hear me when I try to warn her. You ready? Hey, so when I play a lot, my fingers hurt. What do I do to stop them? You don't. Metal strings cut into your fingertips, make them sore. Just how it is. Oh. Don't worry. Play long enough and you'll get callous. You felt bad about Start it. Later. Hitting what do you think you're doing, you little shit? Going out. Where? Uh, just out for a sec. Be back soon. Back inside he now. Was still from the night before. I'm about to let you go out, dude. Who knows what? You hear? For oh, fuck's sake! You swipe my keys again. Inside. Now, you shit. He Leave him alone. About it. Watch that going? tone. Get the fuck out of my face. Think I'm scared? You're another bum like the rest of us. Want to try me? Go ahead. I don't have time for this shit. Who the fuck knows? Another tramp all look the same to me. Oh man, he was shaking like you were gonna wipe him. Sorry about that. <laughs> you kidding? My Steve I talking to him. I wish something bad had happened to him. Hop in. I wish I could drop him myself. I want to be strong like you. You will be down the line. 
Though, sure hope you'll see he's not worth any skin off your knuckles. How come? Because you'll realize how weak he is, and it'll hurt. Where to? Time machine. Nice! Saw Carrie Uridine there once. You a fan? Of the legend? Of course I am! Why? Aren't you? Carrie's alright. Heard something on the radio. About Carrie using Silverhand's death, riding that to fame? Can't do much about media vultures. Got shit for brains, especially the ones who cover music. Carrie's a damn good musician. That's all that counts. The real deal always has been in every way. God, makes it sound like you know him. Cause I do. I'm gonna be a musician someday too. Better have something to fall back on. What? Something. Anything that pays the bills. You'll never grow desperate. Desperate's not a good place to be. The music's in you anyway. It's like blood. It'll always be there. <laughs> Don't forget, it's not the easiest gig. Yeah, yeah, I know. Gotta work hard, practice. To start, sure. But it only gets harder after that. The critics, the haters, non-stop pressure, batshit crazy lifestyle. It can chew you up. Gotta start scribing songs then. You'll get good with practice, like anything else worth doing. Sooner you start, the better. Got a few tunes in my head already. Preem. Lyrics don't come easy though. I come up with anything, seems like it's already been done or it just sounds stupid. I kinda don't really know what to write about. Be honest. Only ever write the truth. Especially when it comes to your feelings. I don't get how I could lie about my feelings. Don't write love songs if you're not head over heels. Don't write sad sex shit just because you think there's beauty in sadness. Um, uh, okay. When something really hits you in the gut, that's when you sit down and write. Truth's elusive. Sometimes music's the only way to grasp it. We have arrived. Preem, hang here a minute. I'm coming in. Flip through the new releases. What can I do for you? Heard Carrie Uridine pops by once in a while. Best music story in Night City. Probably nothing new. Everybody pops we'll by see. occasionally. No why else they come? No, but got a feeling I'm about to find out. I don't snoop on customers, don't keep no record, and I don't run my mouth. So, how can I help you? Looking for a six string, electric. Feast your eyes. I want something solid and true. What, and they're not? Rattle on the low E, cause the next boat. Nothing a screwdriver won't fix. Cheap clunker is made out of shit plywood that itself was made out of unseasoned veneers. Still playable, just gotta know how. Most important thing is the pickups. Guitarist gotta have something decent there. Don't give half a fuck how it looks. Okay. No offense, but I'm looking for a real instrument. And willing to pay real money. Ah, oh, should have said so. Come on, let's go out back. I'm coming too. Sure, you might learn something.
How's this? Whoa! To the Fucking right awesome. and left, the latest chromatics and Hendersons. Vintage axes in the back. Deleuze Orphean. Not a fake. Take a good look. Relax, just making sure. Looks authentic, well maintained. Must be around, shit, 70? 90 and still going strong. Fretboard's pure organic ebony. Wanna try this one? Be my guess. I'ma let you two play around in here alone. Else those savages out front will kill out. Never ever heard anyone play Silverhand like that. You know, I read he never took any lessons. Chum was totally self-taught, made up his own style. How do you do that? I mean, sound just like him. Practice every day and you'll play like that. Maybe better. You can learn anything, I promise. Uh, I don't know. I can learn a few riffs by heart, but it'll only ever be performing, never next gen. Good point. That's why it's better to invent your own jam. That's what practice is for. And talent. Talent you got. Really? You think so? What? Don't, don't think you're any good? A little self-criticism is useful. But believing in what you got, that's much more important. A real rocker boy. Doubt that'll be me, ever. Come on, have faith. I just don't say things I don't think are true. Not anymore. Best day ever. Fuck! My hands are shaking. Rockers are rebels. They always speak their minds. Tried once with my dad, you know. Didn't go so well. In time, you'll learn who you really are, what you really want from the world. I don't understand. Want to be a real rebel? Got to be yourself first. Be authentic. Rebels are made, not born. Made from the punches life throws at them. The punches they take. You know, you're weird. But I like you anyway. Huh. You're all right, kid. Gonna play some more? Nah, short on time. Let's pay. Delta out of here. I'll take it. And? Excellent choice. Glad to see she'll be in, uh, in good hands. Help you with anything else? No thanks. Here you go. See ya. Let's Delta. Still got some biz to take care of. All right. All right. Let's roll. Sure thing. Where to? The cemetery. You got it. My dad says there's gonna be another Cope War. Liable to jump at each other's throats any day now. Think it's true? Think there'll be another war? Asking the wrong guy. Got no interest in the topic. Couldn't care less, to be honest. Know why? Why?
because I realized I don't have to. Got a friend who lives around here. Where? Can't see it from here. Just saying. He a good friend of yours? Invited me over to his house once. His mom made lunch. Then we went and hung out on the bridge. I like driving through here. It's nice. City looks alive. Um, because everyone's out walking around? Not what I mean. It's like we created a monster and never even noticed when it started to eat us alive. <laughs> like Frankenstein? Frankenstein's monster, you mean. You know what, you're right. It is nice out here. Never been out this way? No, I have. Just never noticed. Never had time to just sit down and watch. City slipped through my fingers. Just sped right by. Passed underfoot, overhead, and I can't even say when it happened. Gonna write a song about it? Maybe. Whoa! I didn't know you had a gun. Hella preem. My dad used to sell ones like those. You gonna shoot someone? No, it's just a keepsake. Um, belong to someone important, right? Hmm. Important doesn't even come close. What are you gonna do with it? Put it back where it belongs. Can I come with? No, wait here, okay? Won't be long. Okay. To now. Hey, hey, what's this? Want one? Gave all that up. So should you. Bad for your body. Bad for your soul. Where to now? Me? Nowhere. But you'd better get home, Steve. Thanks. The person you just... Uh, visited. He died a while ago? Not that long ago. You miss him? A little, yeah. When my grandpa died, I missed him a lot. 
but now I only miss him sometimes. Hmm. in the shade and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you for all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City with a certain V in the lead role. Uh... I don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. 
You're an all the call, though. Remember that. Ah, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, V, so funny thing just said. Oh, fuck, fuck's sake. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. What did I even... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, over oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, uh, who knows? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out! Hey, so, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. And I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Hey, it's Perales. V, you're gonna want to hear this. But first, you need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She, she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at the lab. And, and they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, well, when, when you got a sec, call me, okay? Oh, yeah. And don't forget to delete this message. Hey, V. Sorry to bother you. I know you're a busy man and everything. Well, I was wondering how you were doing, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. The Hanged Man. The Magician. The Star. Those... Those are not good cards, V. They're really bad. They're something like death, but... Not quite. Take care of yourself, okay? I'll... I hope to hear from you soon. If you're not ready to die, then you're gonna live. You lied to me from the start. So what do I do, Walt? Simply cross the bridge. V's life will be restored as it was before. You will become part of something greater. Got to know each other. And I'm sorry. I don't want to die. Who does? I just don't see a way out. We'll find a way. No, Johnny. We won't. We're out of options. And I don't have the strength to keep fighting.
Good morning, G. I trust you had a restful night. Mm -hmm. You have no new messages. You have one meeting planned today. At the afterlife, Delamain has confirmed a vehicle arrival at the arranged time. I've noticed your calendar is empty for what remains of the month. Would you like me to begin planning? No, thanks. That's as it should be. Perfect. Have a nice day. Hey, boss. Hey, you there yet? Not yet. It'll be on time, though. His people came to scan the place earlier. Check and make sure everything's clean before he arrived. <laughs> Thought we didn't notice him. And the gear? All set with the heat. Rest, too. Full tank, ready to launch. Thanks. Be there soon. Thank you for choosing the Delamain service. Where shall we fly today? The afterlife. Head over there. As you wish. We will be traveling along restricted air corridors. No delays anticipated. Prem. If I may deign, you look frightfully fatigued. Was it a difficult night? Difficult few weeks. I'm truly sorry to hear that. The Delamain Network is pleased to offer complimentary services that may just be the ideal remedy for your current condition. What's more, I'm delighted to inform you that Delamain has joined forces with Trauma Team. With our limited time only Safe Travels package, you have a full range of medical services available to you at your fingertips. As to any medical aid, a day late and an eddy short for that. I'm afraid I don't understand. You've practically unlimited resources at your disposal. I'm certain we can find an appropriate solution. Don't worry about it, though. As you wish. What's going on with Arasaka? And how's the sitch in the city? Here's an item that might interest you. The Arasaka crisis continues. The corporation still teeters. Aggregated media mentions indicate a positively mammoth stain on the corporation's image, as well as financial and political defeat. Secure Your Soul was to be a smashing success for Arasaka. It turned into a horrific curse. They lost all resources related to the program. Mm hmm Promised the rich immortality. Sold them on it. Actually collected engrams and knowledge. A bid for control. For power, I see. Precisely. In any event, it will be some time before Arasaka successfully reorganizes. It seems you, the afterlife, are safe. For now. Get me to the afterlife and floor it. Naturally. I've chosen the optimal route. We'll be arriving shortly. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy the stunning views of our fine city. Might be the last time I get a look at this place. Do you plan to leave Night City? One way or another. In that case, I wish you a swift return home. 
Thank you for choosing this the Delamain service. Have a nice day. day. Is a true West Coast gem. They also call it a metropolis of near paralyzing beauty. Don't doubt it. Box is ready and waiting. Maybe. Get you something? My usual. Sure thing. People can tell something's up. Won't be able to keep it under wraps much longer. Won't have to. Take offs today. Today? Is that a problem? No, no, just... In that case, you're gonna need something special. Rogue had this little ritual. Before any big op, she'd knock back a shot of tequila. Silverhand's preferred. Asked her once if it was for luck or whatever. Know what she said? Said it was about remembering. Said that remembering Johnny that way helped her focus on what was important. Anyways, afterlife tradition. I'm gonna mix you up one of our specials. Just tell me who we're drinking to. Mix me so, up a silver hand. What did hit the spot Drink about Johnny? I mean, I only know what people say about him, but Betty love what you're planning. Shit, you're on the damn moon. I know. Good luck, V. Hey, boss. V. I've long awaited this moment. To look the latest afterlife legend in the eye. I must say, I moved. Happy not to disappoint. Sit, sit. Talk to me. Well, V. Mikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you eddies. Influence around town. But not just that. It meant positive paralysis of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up, my people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's all systems go for the op. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use that moment. Having second thoughts? Hope that doesn't mean you want to drop out. Drop out? At this stage? No. It would make no sense. I'd take a hit. Speaking of which... Nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like this. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. They'd say you're taking too big a risk. Poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. They'd be dead wrong. All of them. Self-confidence worthy of a legend. Or of someone risking it all. <laughs> but I sense you know what it's like to lose everything. To fight for one last breath. I see it in you. This time tomorrow, should have the casino's client data. All of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. Good luck. Right. 
In position. Perfect. Almost to the second. My turn. Hmm. Satellites are down for now. Just got the signal. Signature cloaking activated. Remember, got one shot and one shot only. Now tell me something I don't know. As soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance at extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. Times when I had something to gain are long gone. Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of grim. Then again, who am I to judge? Here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out. Hello, V. How are things? 
weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, V, so funny thing just happened. Oh, fuck, fuck, sake. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. <sighs> what did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them. At first I was like, oh my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait, I could actually be fun. So, uh, what else? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, well, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff. For a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Hey, it's Perales. V, you're gonna want to hear this. But first, you need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She, she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. It says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab. And they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, 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 when, when you got a sec, call me, okay? Oh, oh, yeah. And don't forget to delete this message. Hey, V. Listen, I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot. I know, I know the reading's not as strong without you here, but we haven't seen each other for so long, and I... Well, one thing led to another. Know what I drew? Strength, the Emperor, and the world. Babe, the world's gonna hear about you. Go and show Night City what you're made of.